Whoa! Look at all these wonderful fruits of our labor. With the searching skills and evaluation skills we have learned, we have found this relevant information on various syndromes, diseases of overuse of hands and arms, like tennis elbow, trigger thumb, and etc. Yes, it is labor, all right. After typing at the computer for long hours, I think I've overused my wrists, and they are painful. I think I'm getting carpal tunnel syndrome. I must do something to relieve it. Haha! -ha, at least you have not overused your brain after learning all the time-saving, efficient, and effective information searching and evaluation skills. After finding these information, you now know what it is that's afflicting you, the causes, the symptoms, and the treatments, don't you? This is exactly what our community health project asks for. We have to design and prepare patient education materials for the general public about diseases of the overuse of hands and arms. I think these are the topics that can go into the materials. Any other suggestions? I suggest that we find some readily available patient education materials in databases and model ours on them. Don't forget, after preparing the education materials, we also need to write up a report on the whole project. No worries. We have tons of relevant information to write up the report. But how do we get about using useful information and then creating our report? I think I am the one who have overused the brain. Easy. Just copy here and there and paste together. You will get us all killed by doing so. Haven't you heard of plagiarism? Don't you remember that we have to cite sources on other people's works we have used? Just kidding! With all these skills we have learned from the library and the wonderful information found, let's start up our creation mode and get an A for this project! Yes! yes. <laughs>